In the realm of spaceflight, a flurry of activity is set to unfold, with Russia taking center stage. The week spanning from August 7 to August 13 promises two significant missions from Russia, launching their fourth-generation radio navigation satellite, GLONASS-K2, and embarking on Roscosmos's momentous lunar mission, Luna 25. Russia's GLONASS-K2 satellite takes flight. On Monday, August 7, the Russian Space Force is slated to propel the first of its fourth-generation GLONASS-K2 satellites into space. This innovative satellite, created by ISS Reshetnev, bears resemblance to systems like Galileo and GPS, offering advanced radio satellite navigation capabilities. It will be launched aboard a three-stage Soyuz 2.1B, Forgot M rocket from the Plesetsk Cosmodrome in Russia. The GLONASS K2 satellite, weighing in at 1,645 kg, is designed for an 11-hour, 15-minute, and 44-second orbit. This launch marks the beginning of a constellation of 24 satellites, set to operate for a decade. Distinguished by enhanced power, precise chronometers, and additional CDMA signals, the GLONASS K2 is a substantial advancement over its predecessor, GLONASS K. Virgin Galactic's pioneering private space tourism flight. A groundbreaking moment in space tourism is set to occur on Thursday, August 10 as Virgin Galactic embarks on its second commercial mission, Galactic O2. This voyage will carry three private passengers into space on board the Spaceship 2 VSS Unity spacecraft. The launch is scheduled from Spaceport America in New Mexico. Galactic O2's crew is an eclectic mix, including pilots C. J. Stersko and Kelly Latimer, Virgin Galactic's chief astronaut instructor Beth Moses, and private customers John Goodwin, Keisha Shahef, and Anastasia Mayers. Among them, John Goodwin stands out as the second person with Parkinson's disease to travel to space. Keisha Shahef and Anastasia Mayers, on the other hand, make history as the first mother-daughter duo to venture into space, hailing from the Caribbean islands. Russia's return to lunar exploration with Luna 25 mission. A momentous event awaits space enthusiasts as Russia's Roscosmos embarks on its first lunar mission since 1976. The Luna 25 mission is part of a pioneering lunar exploration program. Scheduled for liftoff on Friday, August 11, this mission will launch from the Vostochny Cosmodrome, marking a significant milestone for lunar exploration. Luna 25, also known as Luna Glob Lander, is a Russian lunar lander set to investigate the Moon's south polar region. Equipped with sophisticated scientific instruments, including a robotic arm for soil samples and drilling equipment, the spacecraft will scrutinize the composition of the lunar polar regolith and its exosphere. With a lifespan of at least a year, Luna 25 is poised to unlock new insights into our celestial neighbor. Closing Thoughts As August unfolds, the spaceflight landscape is brimming with activity. Russia's dual missions, encompassing satellite navigation and lunar exploration, demonstrate their commitment to pushing the boundaries of space science. Additionally, Virgin Galactic's private space tourism journey represents a monumental leap towards making space travel accessible to all. With each launch and endeavor, humanity inches closer to unraveling the mysteries of the cosmos.